Aloha angels. Good morning. Welcome stateside. Oh my goodness. Last time you guys saw us we were in Paris, France, and now we are in Orlando, America. Florida. Oh, sorry. So, hello angels, how are you guys? I've missed you guys so much. Welcome to a American vlog. I'm so excited. We arrived here really late last night. I'm really sorry we didn't film any of like the airport footage or kind of when we were at home. Literally, okay, right, Cod, you're gonna have to help me out with this, these statistics. We got off the plane at Paris at like two o'clock in the afternoon on Saturday. We got home at like half past three, four o'clock. Yeah, I think it was about quarter past four we arrived home. That's a very specific Oh, I remember You're it. really good at stuff like that. And um, then we, um, well, I unpacked, Connor went straight to the gym. I had absolutely no idea how you found the it's motivation done. angel, but you, want you know what I mean. Um, I unpacked, put a massive load of washing on, and then I packed again, cleaned the house, Kind of got Herbie ready for going to Connor's parents because that is where he is staying for the next couple of weeks, which he absolutely he loves there. adores already, being there. Already got picture updates already. And it was just a really, really hectic time, so I didn't film anything when I was at home. And then yesterday, the, the flight and everything was okay, like it was really easy, but it was just like a long, long flight from Gatwick. Nine Do you know hours. what I mean? I still was at nine hours. Long last time. flight. It was just everything about it seemed to be like delayed, extra long. So anyway, I arrived really late last night, probably about ten o'clock Orlando time. It is now 6 a.m. in the morning well, and we have an extremely busy day planned. <clears throat> when we landed as well, it was 2 a.m. UK time. Yeah, and then we were in the airport for like two hours after that because lucky for Slade. Oh, I do honestly, it was just such a nightmare. If you guys haven't been sort of keeping up to date with my vlogs and everything, you're probably thinking, hang on a minute, what on earth are they actually doing in America? So let me explain, let me brief you guys. Okay, so not too long ago, like this has been a really quick turnaround trip. We were invited out here on a press trip with a company which basically just provide customers with like a really cool experience in any theme park to come out here to Orlando and do some work with Universal and obviously we jumped at the opportunity like I am just so I just actually can't even believe that like this is my real life. I'm so excited to be here. But we do have a really, really busy schedule because we're going to be getting some content for Universal as in the actual theme park today. But before we go, I just want to show you guys my makeup today. I know you can't really see it because I'm literally stood in front of what seems like the brightest lights at the moment. Okay, that's a lot better right now. Okay. So I've opted out of foundation today because I've been using my Clarins moisturizer, my facial moisturizer and my Clarins um, fake tan drops for the face. I'll show you guys them now. This is the facial moisturizer. It's got some SPF 15 in there and then these are the fake tan drops. And at first I was definitely a little bit like, oh, I don't know if these are really working, but after using them for like, um, I would say three days, I can definitely, definitely tell the difference, which is why I'm really kind of just like comfortable with not wearing foundation today because I feel like my face is tanned enough and also I just feel like wearing foundation around Universal on a hot day like it's going to be 30 degrees today like who has time for that not me but I also have used my Born This Way um Too Faced Concealer I got this in shade Fair and then on my lips I am wearing oh my gosh I need to show you guys this this okay so this is my new absolute favorite beauty product in the entire world it's the YSL lip balm I think it's actually called like the night what's it called okay this is it the liquid color balm I bought this at the airport yesterday they were like 21 pounds at the airport I think so at the moment I am wearing this one which is um number four but I did also buy this one which is shade number one and that is like a really lovely cute baby pink kind of color and so that looks really nice when i don't have any makeup on i didn't have any makeup on for the flight yesterday so i wore that one yesterday and um yeah i'm wearing this color today outfit okay so my dress is from asos just thought this would be like a really nice easy option today primark sandals and then my bag and our room is literally like stupidly messy okay. right now so it doesn't look very glam you but you got in chuck that suitcase yeah straight went to straight to bed you to get straight back out okay are we ready to go i think we are here we go team we've we got one each cabana bay cabana bay oh my god i forgot it's like 6 30 am i'm gonna be getting that shot connor loves to get portrait shots to put on his instagram story but it, it just makes it really hard for you doesn't it come because his arm literally has to be like Oh, yeah. yeah, go on, boo. Concho, it's an OOTD today. Ooh la la. Converse. You're going to be way too hot in that jacket, honey. He insisted, though. You know when they're just like, no, I'm 
wearing it. It's not like I can't take it off. Oh it's yeah, like, oh yeah. Like That's going to be a massive faff to carry around all day, what? isn't it, so Con? Didn't think mate. of that, did you, mate? Got yeah. Got backpack, I thought of it. Oh, it looks so pretty. Here's the um, dining area. Thank you. Not quite ready for the world yet. Sorry, a bit early. Oh, yeah. Right. <gasps> Con, they got a frozen yogurt bar. Oh my god, how have I only just spotted that? Oh my god, the fruit out of here! <sighs> hey Angels, it is 7.52 in the morning, on a Monday morning, and we have been on that ride two twice. times! Twice! Smashed it What twice. did you think, Con? That was like, okay, that was, I feel like the scariest roller coaster to start off with. What about you? I think it's the most like... Oh my god, we're on a roller coaster sort of thing, you know? We're heading over to Harry Potter World, which I'm about to cry. Here we go. early, so it's very still. Yeah. Um, so you get a you customers get a are just walking in. I'm looking, forward to, I'm looking forward to this one here. What is that? Transformers. Oh yeah. Yeah. Where are we to, Al? Well, we're walking to Harry Potter Land. And I just need to say, everybody, I actually cannot get over how magical this place is. Do you agree, Con? Even just walking through, okay, it's 8 a.m. Like, people have just started to walk in the doors. It's cloudy. It Everyone's doesn't matter. racing about. There is just such a vibe. It is so magical and amazing here. I'm so happy to be here. Got some wands. It's so sick. I'm Dumbledore. I got, I'm Ron. Very Because he's scared of spiders like me. Apparently, you can literally like use these to be like as an interactive basis in Harry Potter world and like magic yes. things happen. So in Harry Potter world, they have like windows where you sort of stand and do your spell. I'll put a spell on you. Look on the night bus. Look the night bus. I'll show it. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh, Con. Look where we are. Hello everybody, we are about to walk into Diagon Alley. <gasps> oh my goodness, Connor. We're here to do some shopping for our school year. Ron's brother's shop. Quidditch. Quidditch. Flourishing blocks, school books. Oh my gosh, what a vibe. <gasps> Who are these little witches over here? That. Come on, they're witches, look. They're witches. Okay, so this is our lovely tour guide for the day, Gabby, and she's about to show us some secret wand spots. I'm very excited. So in here in Gringotts Money Exchange, you can actually talk to one of the goblins in there because they're the protectors of the money, and you can exchange your normal muggle currency for Gringotts banknotes. Oh my. It's you, Con. Oh, it's you, working at the bank. Oh my goodness, Con! What's he doing that? Well, the dragon might be doing something oh, that dragons do really well. Ready? Try it. We're gonna give it a go. Just popping down the pub. <laughs> Just going down the pub for a quick pint with our wands. <laughs> get me a bit. <laughs> what else can we get? I'm gonna get dragon scale. Oh no, Con. You love your pushy cream ale. Oh. You like butter. giddy water. Uh, okay, we have our first cup of butter beer. Cheers. Cheers. It's That's good, so Con. It is good. You want to go? There you are, little Derby. As good as you remember. <laughs> I can live. No. <laughs> Here we are. So me and Els just met the goblin. What's his name, Els? 
Ellie thinks that he... He just reminds me of, of her. Of Herbie. He doesn't look like Herbie. I don't know why, guys. It's his nose, I think, and his eyes. Is that it? He's got, like, big eyes. Oh, where's he gone? Oh, there he is. He's working for me. Oh, sorry, sorry. Leave him alone, Christ. Listen, yeah, it's please. like half nine in the morning we get an ice cream. It's not that early, is it? Yeah, it is early. Where are we to? Uh, uh, Florence Floringdale's. Florian Fortescue's ice cream parlor. That's what we're getting now. Else, you have to try ones. one of every single one. Oh. Good. This is so good. Does it taste like the? Yeah. Come on. Then. Yeah, he's going to finish that off, guys, because he literally will. I was just told I looked awful. How rude. I've got my Gryffindor robe on. Mirror. You can get literally pretty much any costume that was in the movies in this shop. So they've got Neville's sweater that they wore in the last one. There. Every robe from every house. Oh my god, do you know what? I actually love this robe. Oh, you look absolutely brilliant. Oh, thank you. You've changed your mind now. Oh, here he is, copying me. Hello. Oh, you like the trend Did you hear that? Guys, not being funny, but look who we're all meeting. Thank you, you. Emily and the fam are currently, you know, taking the spot like that. We just met Bumblebee and Optimus Prime. Connor was in his element. It was so much fun. Oh, my goodness. That's Simon. Go on, Simon. Go on, Simon. Are you there? Go on. There it is. Hey! What was that? I don't want to show up. Aww. Oh, she loves it. She's come to life now. Yeah, she, she really has. Yeah. Oh. Hello. Can I have a hug? Oh, he's giving me kisses. Oh. <laughs> Lunch time, my favourite part of the day. We've literally had the busiest morning getting loads and loads of different shops and going on all the different rides. Um, and now we have come to the VIP restaurant, which is called Cafe La Bamba, I think. And it's like a buffet style. So I'll show you guys what I get. Oh my goodness. Wow. This is Connor's favourite bit. Oh, thank you so much. Salad bits. Ooh. Oh, yeah, that mac and cheese looks good. Okay, I haven't vlogged in literally a really, really long time. In between now and when I last saw you, I had one outfit change. We had a whole afternoon at the park, but we were doing quite a lot of sort of behind the scenes stuff, going on rides and that meant that I couldn't vlog. So, here we are in the evening. It is about half past six and we have a busy evening planned which I'm so looking forward to. Today we, um, we did lots and lots of rides and we literally went straight onto the roller coasters. Like we didn't- It was like bang, one yeah. ride to the next, to the next. Yeah, we didn't next. walk through the main entrance point of, of Orlando, if that makes sense. We had to do a couple um, of rides like two or three times as well. Yeah. It was- it was incredible, like, it, oh my gosh. We felt so sick at the end of it, didn't we? We went back yeah. to the hotel room to get ready. Um, but now we're finally going to City Walk, and I'm so excited to be here. I can see the universe. How to train a dragon. How to train your dragon. We've just been asking some... Um, top tips of Orlando. Yeah, some people, some top tips of Orlando. Apparently they have an unbelievable cinema here. Which sometimes does 4D screenings. Oh my gosh. So I think the plan tonight is to do some milkshake tasting. <laughs> Yummy. And then go to a show. Love the shows here. We have a table reserved at Cowfish, which is our favorite sushi place in the entire world. And um, we actually did come here. We went there when um, we came here last time. So I'm very excited to be going back. Here we are. This place is honestly like totally something else. Ready for shine. We've got two minutes until it kicks off. Still don't know what it 
is, but I think it's fireworks. Okay, look it's at not this view. fireworks. What is it then? It's um, like water fountains. Oh no! And then lagoon. Well, this is our view. It's gonna be right here. It's going to be... <laughs> You had a good day today, babe. Oh yes, Angel. The best. Have you? Only something with you. Exploring the universe. Oh, 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 oh. Guys. There's a T-Rex. Oh, 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 oh. I'm literally not joking. Okay, this is all water. Is that her, babe? What are you saying, <laughs> Here we go then, guys. Our sushi. We are in Cowfish, which is a sushi and steak restaurant, and we actually love it here so much. I've just ordered um, a few Philly uh, roll things. I don't know. Salmon They've got cheese. salmon cheese and abo in. We're not really that hungry, we've had so much to eat today, haven't we? Like, my stomach is not alright, but anyway, I need something to eat. So we're going back. I've got a lot more. <laughs> Volcano Bay, the amazing water park here at Universal. Um, it's bright and early again this morning and you guys can't tell because I have a towel right around me but I am actually already quite wet. We've been on a couple of different rides and everybody else is up Everyone else is doing, doing the rides. We've already done them. We're soaking so we've come down here to sort of chill out. A gorgeous little hut that we have today where we're keeping all of our stuff. This is just like our little base. Um, Honestly, I was like a bit nervous about coming to the water park today because I'm not typically like the biggest water park fan in the entire world. Like I don't know why. I just prefer roller coasters and theme parks. But honestly, this water ride. park. Yeah, we've done one ride and it's unbelievable. It is already. actually like unreal. So we were just on one ride, which I'll show you guys in a sec, and it's like a roller coaster but a water ride, right? Yeah. Hang on. Yeah, so it's this one here. The Krakatau Aqua Coaster and you're on something like that and it goes up and down and it like pulls you by magnetic There's magnets something. in the bottom and it pulls know. you up the pulls you up instead of going down. Anyway, it's, it's just really really cool. Like, like yeah. it's basically just not your average water park. There are some really amazing rides here. Uh, and that's our plan volcano. today. Have you right there. The no. Yeah. Well, they can't really see it from here. I have to show you a different angle, minute. but yeah, it's so good. So we're here till about midday, and then we're heading back into the park, and then this afternoon we are doing Marvel. Marvel, I'm buzzing for that. And what else are we doing? The other thing. Well, it's Island Adventure we're doing, so it's all of the islands. I don't know if I'm going to vlog all of today because I'm aware that this vlog is quite long already, and I actually want to get this vlog up for you guys today. So, let's have fun at the water park. Hope you guys have enjoyed the vlog so far. If you have, please make sure you give it a big thumbs up. And let's get back to going on the ride. We'll show you one of the rides now. There it is, guys. The big volcano. This is honestly, like, such a big water park. They have so many cafes and restaurants. <laughs> That's 
you next, son. So we're about to go on one of these plunge. They plunge? Trap door. It's a trap door. It's a trap door. And you literally just fall vertically down oh. for hundreds and hundreds of meters. You got 100 miles per hour hours. No, you don't. So we're gonna do that so we can see each other fall. I literally thought I was gonna cry. I didn't think you were gonna do it at one point. Yeah, so. No, I didn't either. Wow, angels. Okay, so we've just got back to our gorgeous little cabana and they have kindly brought out a lovely fruit platter with some pastry. So we're gonna munch on this for a little bit. Honestly, we literally just went on the scariest ride I've ever been on in my entire life. I literally didn't think I was going to do it. I nearly started to cry. I thought I was going to have a panic attack, but I did it. And it's very scary. Uh, but I would highly recommend. Connor, what did you think of the ride we just went on? Scary. I open. I feel like my whole perception might have changed. <laughs> Even a split second did not believe I was going to make it out alive. You were ready to go. Well, yeah, I was. And I was like, no else, come on, push through. You literally go through a trap door, guys, and fall vertically down. And that's when the trap door opens. Yeah. And then you go. Bro, scary. And, and then you go down the so longest fast, slide ever. The water sort of catches you by surprise. You yeah. Free and it's dark, and you're like, is this real life? Is it not? Yeah. Scary, yeah. Anyway. But it's fun. You having a fun day? 10 out of 10. Oh, look. It's the Ellie Derby, you all know and love. Hey boo, it's me, the real me. Me and you, chilling with the camera. Got my turban on, because I just got out of the shower, because we just got back from the water park. Um, I have actually just been editing this video for the last couple of hours, because I really want to get it up for you guys today. The UK is five hours ahead of where we are, so I know it's Tuesday night, and I know I really, really want to get this video up for you guys so we can stick to our schedule. Um, but I do just want to say, to end the video, I. I am fully aware, like, I really appreciate that this video is so scrambled and it's, like, so all over the place and there's not really a structure to it. And I realised, like, I didn't get a bunch of footage in the theme parks. Um, and that was just, honestly, because we are working with Universal, which is an amazing experience and we've met some absolutely fantastic people and we, we really are having the best time. Like, I have had a lot of um, comments from you guys asking if I'm having a really, really good time. And of course, like, we are having the time of our life. Oh my God. There's a thing on my camera and it makes me feel like I have something on my cheek, but I don't. Okay, anyway. We are getting a lot of, like, shots with photographers and videographers and um, it's kind of hard to get them in the vlog. And I don't know, like, how much footage you actually want to see of, like, us coming on and off of roller coasters. So I, I, I've always felt like theme parks are a really difficult one to vlog. But um, Monday and Tuesday have been, like, the busiest days of our week's schedule. So as of tomorrow, we have, like, a lot more free time. There will be so many more, like, structured American vlogs where we can actually, like, take you guys out and have some fun. Different fun. Not, like, theme park fun because this is the like most amazing place on earth you guys would also see love it here so much but yeah we can actually like vlog properly so i just want to say i'm really really sorry that this vlog seemed so all over the place and like one minute we were here one minute we were there but yeah we truly are having the best time orlando is probably my my favorite place in the entire world like universe especially is just so happy and amazing and me and connor just both feel so 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 extremely lucky to be here um and i really hope you guys are enjoying our content so yeah
love you guys so much thank you so much for watching this video um when we're out here in america i'm gonna try really hard to stick to my schedule of thursday and sunday and tuesdays for my uploads but i will just have to keep you guys updated on my instagram stories um hopefully we'll have like some extra videos over the next couple of weeks because we'll just be doing regular vlogs if you do want to see that then make sure you give the video a big thumbs up and let me know in the comments below as well love you guys so much and we will see you in the next one love you guys bye